My name is Erica Hamden. I am a professor of astrophysics at the University of Arizona and a 2019 TED Fellow. And I'm here today to talk about the science behind Amazon's original series, The Expanse. I love science and space in particular because it is like the coolest thing ever. I feel like almost everyone that works in space in some way knows about The Expanse because it does such a good job exploring the science of space travel in a relatively realistic way. Gravity is complicated and awesome. <sighs> The way that we experience it here on Earth is we feel this continuous pull downward because of the mass of the Earth. When you're in space and you don't have a large object around, there's these two other ways to create or simulate the impact of gravity. So one of them is just thrust. If you're in a spaceship, like heading out and you're accelerating, that acceleration feels the same to your body as being on Earth. The other way of doing it is using spin. So like rotational force will tend to drive you outwards. So in this shot, you see the rotating spacecraft and then the camera moves inside. And it does this really interesting thing where the angle at which you're watching sort of flips upside down. And that's because when you make gravity in this way, like spin gravity, the orientation of the gravity is maybe opposite of what you would assume. The people walking around, their feet are closest to the edge of the ring. There's a lot of other weird effects that happen when you spin something. And one of them is this Coriolis effect. If you're away from the equator of the body that's spinning, it'll cause an object that is moving in a seemingly straight line on the body will be deflected towards the equator. In this scene where Miller is pouring a drink, he obviously spends a lot of time in this space because he knows exactly the distance that the effect will have to get his whiskey from the can into the glass. One of the great things about this scene is that there's almost no discussion about it. It's just like a thing that happens and that's it. It just like sets the world. And I actually think this is the only show that I've ever seen that actually treats this effect like a real thing. And that's pretty awesome.